Combining versus depth and versus time capability, Azurite is a formation test analysis module of the CAPA workstation. Capable of loading data from all the formation test provider tools, the module is designed to build pressure and mobility profiles, identify fluid contacts, and carry out detailed pressure transit analysis on each test. Although it is common to find formation tests performed during field development, Generally, these are carried out during the appraisal phase of a field using wireline tools. Formation tests while drilling is also of increasing significance. Different tool configurations can be run depending on reservoir conditions and objective of the operation. In Azurite, it is possible to load a large number of files with different formats in a single step. These can be open hole logs or versus depth data and stations or versus time data. Azurite will automatically identify the type of file, tool, and service provider based on the identified mnemonics. The load process allows the user to select the required reference channel for pressure, temperature, and volumes and to identify automatically tests for each station. The ProFlow coefficient considers the geometry of tool and wellbore to compute and estimate a spherical mobility. The pressure change with time is displayed in the Stations tab of Azurite, allowing a more detailed look at each station. It is possible to identify the hydrostatic pressure, which is measured just before and just after the tool is set on the formation. During the drawdown period, the pressure declines and then builds up during the shut-in. In the latter stage, we identify the reservoir pressure. After acquisition, the data can be loaded in Azurite, which automatically identifies the test for each station and the pressures for each stage based on different criteria. Each test at each station can be analyzed in detail by redefining the stop pressure regression line or the drawdown pressure. These parameters impact on the quality of the test and on the calculation of the spherical mobility. For some tests, it is possible to carry out pressure transit analysis to make a detailed reservoir characterization of the zone. In this case, we see a test with the sampling period defined by a long drawdown and buildup stages. By selecting the test, it is possible to seamlessly switch to the analysis display. The creation of a new analysis honors the tool type, geometry, and the reservoir fluid properties. The analysis interface and models will be familiar to Sapphire users. Generally, the buildup of a formation test station displays a spherical and sometimes a radial flow period. The diagnostic lines help to calculate preliminary results of the data leading to a model generation with nonlinear regression to improve the fit as necessary. The pressure and mobility results of the pressure transit analysis can be compared to those from the automatic calculation carried out at the station. The user can decide the parameters to be used on the pressure and mobility profile. Probe to probe vertical interference tests are very common during formation test operations. The model is built to study the pressure response in the active probe and in observation probes located at a vertical distance or at a defined angle with respect to the sink. We observe how the tool is positioned to record pressure at different depths. After the acquisition, the data can be displayed in Azurite in versus depth view. Open hole logs and deviation surveys can be displayed together with station pressures and mobilities to carry out a better interpretation of the data. User-defined tracks can be added to allow a combination of required logs. In this case, density and neutron porosity logs are combined to identify gas zones. The horizontal scale of any curve can be edited and locked. Additionally, filled areas can be added to the user tracks. Gradient lines can be defined from the pressure point selected. If different faces are found, fluid contacts are generated automatically. In this example, the log behavior follows the pressure trend on this data. A predefined density line can be created to be compared with data results. This concludes the introduction to Azurite Formation Test Analysis Module. To learn more about this or any of the other CAPA modules, browse the website for literature, 
More videos and example data or contact support at kappaeng.com or your local Kappa office.